Hello students, let's work out the following problem. It says, 300 apples are distributed equally among a certain number of students. Had there been 10 more students, each would have received 1 apple less. Find the number of students. So let's now move on to the solution. We have to find the number of students. So let the number of students... be equal to x. Now we are given that number of apples is equal to 300. Therefore, the number of apples received by each student is equal to number of apples upon number of students, right? Now, if there would have been 10 more students, then the number of students So the number of students increased by 10. So the number of students will be x plus 10 and the number of apples received by each student is equal to number of apples upon number of students. Now we are given that if there would be 10 more students, then the number of apples received by each student will be one less than the earlier. Now earlier each student receive 300 upon x apples and when there are 10 more students apple received by each student is 300 upon x plus 10 and in this case each student receives one less apple so this is according to question Now taking LCM, LCM would be x into x plus 10. So here we have 300 into x plus 10 minus 300 into x is equal to 1. Now this implies 300x plus 3000. 300 into x is 300x, 300 into 10 is 3000, minus 300x upon x into x plus 10 is equal to 1. Now we have 3000 is equal to 1 into x into x plus 10. So this implies... 3000 is equal to x square plus 10x and this implies x square plus 10x minus 3000 is equal to 0. Now we'll factorize this quadratic equation. So we have x square plus 60x minus 50x minus 3000 is equal to 0. Taking x common, we have x into x plus 60. Taking minus 50 common from the last two terms, we have minus 50 into x plus 60 is equal to 0. So this implies x minus 50 into x plus 60 is equal to 0. 
and this implies x minus 50 is equal to 0 or x plus 60 is equal to 0. Now this implies x is equal to 50 or x is equal to minus 60 but since x is the number of students it cannot be negative. So we have number of students is equal to 50. So this completes the question and the session. Bye for now. Take care. Have a good day.